We've just upgraded the Font Awesome library to include Instagram. This video is about using Font Awesome to put links like this in the top bar, these little like Twitter logos and other logos. To do this, you go to the back office and settings and templates, and down the bottom here, there is a place where you can add a link. Now, to add a link, you just drag a new thing up from the bottom, pop it in here. To get the link, the Font Awesome link in this case, we're going to use, uh, go for the Instagram one. So just type Instagram, and uh, here it is. Now it comes in various sizes, I'm just going to use the, the, the standard one. But if you go to more examples, you can get times two, times three, four, five, etc. to make bigger ones. Just copy that, go back to your settings, put in the link. Now, in between these two arrows here, you can type something which will show up. So if you put in Instagram, for example, you'll see the words Instagram written in here. Now, you need to put your the link to your Instagram page in here. So it's very important that you put HTTP colon colon and then dub dub dub. Then there'll be forward slash whatever your uh, page is. We don't actually have this, so I'm just leaving it there. So click update. And now go back here and refresh. Yep. And there we go. You've got your Instagram logo in the top menu bar, or we call it static link bar. This is really um, territory for graphic designers, but as you can see, not too hard to have a go yourself.